In this class, you are going to learn the rate analysis of plastering cement mortar 1 to 6 12 mm thick for brickwork. So, in this, so plastering means the unit will come in meter square. So, plastering will calculate length and breadth. So, in this, we are going to calculate the wet mortar. So, plastering means we require the mortar. So, in this mortar, we are going to calculate the cement and the sand quantities. So, first we are going to calculate the wet mortar. So, wet mortar, it is 100 meter square. 100 meter square area is there. So, you are going to multiply the thickness of that. So, thickness will be 12 mm thick. So, you will get the volume. Volume required for plastering of 100 meter square that is 1.2 meter cube. So, in this, you are going to add 30 percent more to fill up the joints and the uneven surface. When you construct the brick masonry, there will be some uh, gap between the joints and the surface is not even. For that purpose, we are going to add 30 percent of extra. So, that 30 percent we are going to add extra for in 1.2 meter cube. So, total amount you will get 1.56 meter cube. So, 1.56 meter cube of volume is required. So, in this increase by 25 percent of sinkage allowances. Sinkage allowances means what? Before adding the water, dry volume will be there. So, that dry volume we have to calculate that is 25 percent. So, sand is having some extra uh, voids okay, before mixing the water. So, that 25 percent we are taking it is a sinkage allowances. So, 1.56, so 25 percent add in 1.56, you will get the total 1.95 meter cube. Say it is 2 meter cube. So, 2 meter cube of dry volume is required to prepare the wet volume of 1.56 meter cube. So, now the proportion 1 is to 6 it is mentioned in the problem. Okay, 1 is to 6 it is mentioned. So, for 2 meter cube of 2 meter cube of volume. So, divide the proportion here you will get the 0.285 0.285 meter cube is a volume of cement. So, in this we are going to convert into bags. You multiply 28.8, you will get the bags, 9 bags. Okay, one bag contains 50 kg. So, in this, you are going to calculate the sand also next. So, 2.85 is your cement quantity. You multiply 6 times, 6 times of the cement, 6 times of the cement because 1 is to 6 cities. So, we will get 1.71 meter cube of sand quantity. Next, you are going to calculate the labor, okay, labor calculations. So, labor calculations, one mason, one mason can do 12.5 meter square per day, means he can do it 12.5 meter square work in one day, male mazdur can work 20 meter square per day and female mazdur can also work 20 meter square per day. So, how to calculate the number of mason here? For 100 meter square, one person can work 12.5 meter square. So, the 100 divided by 12.5, you will get 8 numbers here. And number of male mazdur and female mazdur, 100 square meter and they can work for 20 meter square, so you will get 5 numbers here. Okay, these numbers we are going to use it here. So, material calculations, so, plot this, uh, draw this tabular column and then uh, serial number, serial number particular quantity rate and amount. Cement, already we calculated it is 9 bags and sand 1.71 meter cube, multiply their rates 360 rupees and 700 per meter cube. Quantity and rate you multiply, you will get the amount here. So, total amount of material is 6147 rupees. Next is the labor. So, labors are mystery, half day, half numbers is required. These are on 8 hour basis. This is on 8 hour, 8 hour basis. Okay. So, 8 hour mystery. Mystery is a half numbers. Masons, 8 numbers were calculated here. Male and female masters are. 5 numbers, 5 numbers, basically for uh, curing of this, 2 numbers are required and scaffolding. Scaffolding, why the scaffolding is required? Up to 3 or 4 meter we can construct directly, but uh, 
at the top you cannot construct so scaffolding is required means platform to construct at uh, 3 meter height so it is 500 500 rupees lump sum you are putting there so total amount of material and the uh, labor labor amount is 4100 so total material and labor you have to plus and then you have to add some percentage there two percentage of water charges and so in this uh, material and labor you have to do it plus you will get the total amount it is 10,000 to 47 rupees in that we are going to add 2 percent of water charges is 204 rupees and add 3 percent of miscellaneous or tools and plants etc will be 307.41 and add 10 percent contractor profit that is 1024 rupees so you will get the total amount that is 11783 rupees for 100 meter square so for 1 meter square you divide 100 here you will get rupees 170 per meter square rate for plastering of 12 mm thick cement mortar 1 is to 6 